Greetings and salutations to all you folks out there. We're looking at a Supreme Commander 2 waiting screen, and there is a name right below mine that you might not have seen for an extremely long time. We're welcoming back the ever awesome Orbital Potato. How are you doing, man? I'm I'm not too bad. How are you? I'm doing quite well. It has been what, a year and a half at this point? That's what we figure. It's certainly been a while. It's been a very long time. Oh my goodness. Well, the good news is that we're probably both equally terrible at Supreme Commander 2, so we'll neither one of us have any idea what we're doing, and we can just kind of fumble our way through a skirmish and see what happens. <laughs> I was a way to say the good news is that I haven't actually improved um, at video games in any uh, way in the entire year that I've... Oh, I've already mucked it up. Ah, it's fine. I couldn't remember. Like, Supreme Commander 2 is so different. I could not remember whether or not I go first land factory, because that's standard in FAF, and I don't think uh -huh. it is here. So, what are, like, the major differences? I know there's, like, hundreds and thousands of differences. Ah, uh, basically everything. I, I don't know. I couldn't even begin to say. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. We'll, we'll, we'll build some stuff and kill some stuff, and hopefully it won't end in a catastrophe. It's it's worth noting that we are actually fighting against each other here. Yes. Um, for as much um, oh, these controls are just so clunky. I just they just I don't know, I don't know what am I supposed to do? How do yeah, I move I'm, around the map? I'm oh, having okay. to get back into it. Uh, you move around the map with arrow keys or strategic zoom. Probably strategic zoom is the better strategic. one to go for. Yeah. Strategic zoom it is. Yeah. Uh, Hold the middle mouse button there. Okay. It's funny to me, this Open Palms map is actually incredibly similar to the original Subcom map, Open Palms. Uh-huh. I, of course, get that reference. I, oh, of yeah. course, of course. Of course I get that reference, dude. Of course. Um, the next question is, how do I research stuff? Um, you're going to want to build one of those fancy research stations down there. I've got one of them there, fancy research stations. How do I... How do I... Oh, Tech tree? It's like the... Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. It's Tech the top tree right at the top. Corner. Okay. Yup, yup, right. yup. Dude, I've got this. I 100% I have this. It's weird you having a... to look at a tech tree again. Oh, my goodness. It's This whole game is just like... It feels so strange. It, it really does feel very strange. Why can I not... Why am I not building? Have I run out of something? Perhaps... Perhaps, possibly, maybe. I don't know. Oh my goodness. So, is... how many strategy games have you been playing since you came back? Or is this kind Not of many. diving back in uh, this unprepared is... completely? This is like the most intense game, I would say, by a considerable margin. Um, and by considerable, I mean like super considerable. Oh man. Because um, it's like the most intense ones. You know, the other, the other sort of games that I've been playing have been nowhere near as intense yeah yeah i can understand that it, it is kind of a unique thing in rts just the sheer i don't know scale of try hard that is achievable i guess I know. when you're talking about starcraft and supreme commander and all these other things yeah i know what you mean can i can i come in and pay you a visit and see what you're doing no you can't that would be please Oh look, there's a little bot. Oh. Uh, it's all oh. right. It's not like I'm. It's not like I'm doing anything of importance anyway. That uh, would be a rocket. UEF with their little chunky tanks. Yeah, that's exactly it. I'm built. Okay, this is a. <laughs> this is a bad mistake. This is such <laughs> a bad mistake. <laughs> oh no! Uh, it's not I'm, working. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go away. I'm gonna go away. I no, will, no, no, no. Uh, okay. I will right. kill your little tanks and then I'll leave you be. <laughs> I feel that with that, you've probably already struck the uh, the winning blow, I'm, I would hasten to add, but alas, I shall. No, 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 no. I shall. I shall try. I shall try more. I am sure that it is perfectly fine. Yeah, yeah. Fine is exactly the word that I would use to describe this. Hmm. So, have you started posting things back to YouTube already? Yeah, I'm like, I've, I've been going for like, what, a week at this rate? Like a week, Sweet. just about a week? Yeah. So what uh, what got you back in? What's your first ba game coming back? I think it was Civ 6. I always wanted to play more Civ, um, so I really wanted an excuse to play it, so, um, so I thought, uh, why not? That's a decent one. 
Yeah, it's pretty good. And then it's pretty much just been a bunch of sort of casual strategy games since then. Um, but this is definitely the most intense. Have you gotten back into Oxygen Not Included by any chance? I played a bunch of Oxygen Not Included before I uploaded. I oh, I got to like cycle. I I, I got quite far. Um, but no, I haven't got back into it, so to speak. But I do okay. want to do it. Well, I was I've curious what you thought of the new uh, patches that are out, because there's some really cool stuff going on. Rocketry stuff, you mean? Yeah, yeah. They have jetpacks now, and it's completely adorable. <laughs> Everything in that game is completely adorable, honestly. I um, I, I just, I don't know, man. I, I've never been able to get far enough to get to, to the rocketry stuff, so don't spoil. No spoilers, right? <laughs> I never, I never promised to be good at strategy games. Just that, um, just that I could pretend to be good at them. Well, I feel like it's a really delicate balance to be struck between uh, getting good enough to have fun in the game and then just going full tryhard mode and ruining the fun. Yeah, it's uh, it's something that is occasionally difficult to achieve. But yeah, uh, absolutely, absolutely. Try to strike a good balance there. I feel like I'm in a fairly bad position. Um, I would describe my position as fairly bad. <laughs> mediocre uh, at best? I, I think mediocre at best is a little bit overly generous for my situation, Brink. Honestly. I may have forgotten to build any research facilities until just now, so... Well, that's, that, you that's may okay. actually be substantially ahead on research. Who knows? Well, look, I am substantially ahead on research, but I invested all of my research points into um, into air tech, and I have yet to build an air factory. So, you know... Oh, dear. Swing, swings and roundabouts, eh? Yeah, uh, some, something like that. I <laughs> yeah. need to figure out where the stuff is on this tech tree that I want to go for. It's The, the whole tech tree is just, it's just a little bit weird. I don't even understand it at all. Ah... <sighs> Oh, you have a lot of scary blips over there. Yeah, but they're all just engineers. The first thing that I did in my land factory was build six engineers. What a stupid thing to do, eh? Trust me, a... I'm an engineer. What a silly thing to do. I... Oh, is that a point defense? That is a point... Oh, that's your commander. Hello. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back this way and just pretend that nothing happened. There you go. Goodbye. And, uh... Don't come back, actually. Oh dear. I may have to call in the reserves. The reserves, oh no. I I, I only have, I, I mean, I've got nothing. It's it's fine, just pay no mind to the approaching radar oh, blimps. Yeah, you've got aircraft. Bombs away! Oh yeah, it would be great idea if I built some, um, some anti-air stuff. That would be a really, really stellar idea. I mean, you can if you want. Dang it, you, you know killed what? my turret. How dare you. I'll take that. Look, this, How... th that's the only victory I'm going to get dare in, this, you. in this whole game. The only victory. Oh my goodness, I have 1,300 mass. That's great. Spend it. Spend it on all the things. I'm, I'm trying to. Problem is I can't build, uh, can't build fast enough. So... Did you just kill... Oh my goodness, you actually killed some of my air units. You have anti-air. You have anti-air on your tanks. I have no idea, dude. <laughs> it wasn't intentional. I, I swear. It absolutely was not intentional. Well, this is a bit of an annoyance. Sorry. I guess. Uh, I, I I doubt you're actually sorry, but okay. I, I'm not actually. I'll I'll take it. I'll take your fake apology and stick it exactly That's... where it belongs. <laughs> wow, <laughs> dude. <laughs> I always thought you were a, you know, a nice, tranquil dude, but apparently not. Uh, well, you know, sometimes, sometimes games get the better of us all. Don't I'm just going to keep accumulating bombers here, if that's quite all right. Sure. Uh, just go for it, and I'll just keep on accumulating fighters and um, trying to fight off your imagined uh, troops. The Meteor Mobile Missile Launcher. That yeah. seems like a bothersome thing. Doesn't it just? Okay. I'm gonna have to say uh, nope on that one. Mm 
Okay. I just, I just don't even feel like I am confident at all. This is just going so badly wrong. Oh my goodness. I mean, you had a pretty good push up on the right side. Ah, stop killing my tanks. Go away. I feel like I did actually. I had a good, I had a good run. And um, when it all goes south, I can say, you know, I tried. In the end, it doesn't even matter. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> This is just, this is just unreal. Okay, let's get a bunch of that stuff. Bunch of this, bunch of that. Okay. You and your tanks, so persistent. I know, I I, I think that's a great... Um, great character quality to have. A great character quality, that's exactly what I was gonna say. That's exactly that what I was gonna say. That can't be your commander. No, that, that's a tank. That's a tank. You must have gotten some land upgrades because your tanks I are did. reaching a fair bit farther than they did before. I did get land upgrades. That's exactly I what I got. I would appreciate you not because I have not gotten said land upgrades and it's rather frustrating to be outmatched. I can totally believe that, but imagine how it how it's like to be how it feels to be me literally all the time in any game with you ever. <laughs> that's 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 how I feel Except right now. PA. Because you do crush my face in on PA. I, I don't know. I feel that the, the, the problem with um, Planetary Annihilation, right, is that it's only a matter of time before, you know, like the Borg, you adapt, you know? Ah. It's only, it's, it's only a matter of time before you manage to crush me. And before someone does a uh, full conversion mod for uh, Star Trek in Planetary exactly. Annihilation, that would actually exactly. be kind of epic. That would be pretty, that would be pretty dope. I must say, your little rocket launchers here are one of the most annoying things ever conceived of in the history of mankind. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I keep building these little turrets that are supposed to protect me, and then your missile launchers keep coming in and shredding the health off of them. Uh, well, I'll, I'll take that as a compliment, actually. I really will. Um, yeah, dude, I, I feel like I'm... I don't actually feel like I'm doing well, but I feel like I'm... To some degree, holding off the the, the swarm, the you inevitable know? apocalypse to come. That's exact. That's you know what? That's exactly. <laughs> it. That's exactly how I feel. Uh, I may actually need a couple more land factories here because you are um, you are getting a rather scary number of units over there. <laughs> I I wouldn't I wouldn't put it like that honestly. Sitting I, here trying to take the chill route and. Um, uh, under anticipating how much my foe is capable of, as I often do. Well, oh, you fairness, have a lot of tanks over there. Oh dear. In fairness, it's uh, I wouldn't describe it as uh, I wouldn't describe it as a an unusual occurrence, so to speak. Woo, come Maybe here, little anti air. You need to die. Oh, you know you're what happens if all the anti air dies? You're microing your units. That's that's incredible. The bombers right. come after that. Alright, alright, alright. Kill, 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 kill. Aha! Your anti-air is gone. Well done. Very well done. I honestly didn't notice. There we go. Fighters, scramble. Uh, I feel like I should get these guys on a patrol route, you know? There we go. I would just appreciate uh, you not coming into my base. Like that's pretty much all I'm asking for here. Good gracious! That's <laughs> you have so many fighters. Stop! Stop countering me. That's not how this yes. is supposed to work. Sorry about that, dude. Really sorry about that. The I I, I simply don't think that you actually are. <laughs> I, I I actually am, not that's you got me. I tell you what, I love these little dudes. These little dudes are wrecking those factories. Oh man, I love this. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> this is oh, great. Oh boy. <laughs> this is a this is a truly phenomenal occurrence. It is kind of. Um I was not anticipating this much pushback. <laughs> how, how unusual is this on a scale of like 1 to 100? Oh, and you're going around the other side too. What's that? 
Good old orbital, orbital potato. That's fine. We'll, we'll, I wanna, we'll, we'll handle this. I want to destroy your production. That's my, that's my goal. Commander under attack. I tell you what, these upgrades saved my bacon. I'm gonna have to ask you to not. Ooh. Well, what is that? You are building. You are a sneaky booger, aren't you? I may or may not have decided to go for a uh, go for a larger unit to try and deal with you. Commander under a sneaky blighter. But that's okay because I'm working down your uh, your ACU. ACU yeah, ain't I got see much that. Light. Ain't got uh, much life left, dude. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, this is much closer than I would like it to be. Oh dear. It's okay. You've you've. Oh dear. It's okay. Okay, we're good. You've, you've oh no! About the bombers. Crap! The bombers that are incoming. Crap! <laughs> well then. Oh my god. Oh. Oh man, that was. I feel like I shouldn't have won that, right? That was just ridiculous. Those tanks just didn't die. I think. I think that this has all been a ruse. A good old-fashioned ruse where you lulled me into a false sense of security with your claims of, oh, I've not played Supreme Commander in a year and a half. <laughs> you, you got me. You got me, dude. Actually, the day that I retired from YouTube, right, I went straight into Supreme Commander and practiced right up until this moment. Oh, my and goodness. I've been had. Well, that was, I was about to say, was it's either nice. that or the uh, the potato is actually a magical creature that the longer he stays away from a game, the more he just, like, <laughs> absorbs the pure essence of gaming from his surroundings, and then he comes back fresh and ready to go and pounds away at it. <laughs> I just, I, look, I think this was, I think it was research, right? Like, research saved my bacon. It did. Like, Your tanks were so freaking strong for how few you had. I didn't have enough veterancy, I think. Yeah. Research, I mean, not the tanks. I just the the what is it the stars? Is it is that the veterancy at the bottom? Yeah, the it's just like I think it's general ten percent buff across the board, something yeah. like that. Yeah. I had I had I had level five of that. I pretty much beeline straight oh. through that. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Well, I pretty much had level level five of that. I had health regeneration. I had increased health. Pretty much, only for land stuff actually. Um, yeah. I corrected. I corrected my course after I made my initial research into into air. Well done, dude. Yeah. Well played. <laughs> Thanks. I, I feel <laughs> this is a momentous occasion because it's certainly not going to happen again. You know, it's it's going to happen once. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, uh, it is excellent to have Orbital Potato back. If you have enjoyed this or generally enjoy hearing his uh, lovely voice, then you should definitely check out his channel. There's going to be a link in the description and. There will probably be another Subcom 2 video over there about the same time as this one. So I'm sure he'd love to have you, and I have loved having you here as well, man. Appreciate it. Cool. Bye. All right, see y'all. That is going to wrap everything up for this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, feel free to drop a like and share it with someone. If you want to support the channel, catch the streams, or join the Discord, check out the links in the description. Thank you all for being at least partially insane, and I will see you in the next one.